Since Goku has unleashed his Ultra Instinct mode once again in the battle with Kefla, it seems like he enters this mode almost by accident when fighting strong opponents in the Tournament of Power. Cometbook.com has broken down Ultra Instinct in the past as a state of power rather than a traditional Dragon Ball transformation. This new state of being brings his key to a godly level, and even makes the God of Destruction Beerus nervous, because this state is usually impossible to obtain without years of harsh training. But a Japanese theory posits the world avoids empty environment. An energy could be boosting Goku's affinity for this new state might be relevant to mention that there was a theory floating on Japanese forums that somehow the environment of World of Void triggered Ultra Instinct. SSB was earned in an alternate dimension which was of God energy, same way UI might be a result of Void energy. Https.coisp7azov. Kenzairo at Kenzairo November 16, 2017 with Goku obtaining Super Saiyan Blue through exposure to Beerus Planet's godly energy. It would make sense that helps been slowly gaining power from this new pocket universe too. There's even a precedent for this in Dragon Ball Z. Goku initially learned the Kaioken technique on King Kai's high gravity planet even though he was technically dead. He first reached Super Saiyan level by fighting Frieza on Namek, and while it was a result of his higher emotional state you could argue Namek's environment had something to do with it as well. He reached Super Saiyan 3 off-screen in the afterlife, and the Saiyans in general are a race that grew stronger by traveling to other worlds and conquering them. Remembering all of this coupled with the fact his first transformation to the Ultra Instinct state was sparked by the Spirit Bomb, a technique which draws in the energy from the environment, and this new theory sounds all the more feasible. As natural of a fighting talent Goku is, it makes too much sense to argue HES essentially a walking energy sponge as well. Despite draining a ton of stamina during this universal survival arc, HES still pushing forward with enough power to fight off the fusion of Kale and Cauliflower. Not to mention, HES most likely going to need a source of energy if he wants a proper rematch with Jiren. What do you think of this Ultra Instinct theory? Talk to me at Valdezology and we'll figure it out together. Dragon Ball Super airs on Crunchyroll and Funimation now Saturdays at 715 p.m. CST. The English dub airs on Adult Swim's Toonami Block. Saturdays at 1130 p.m.